So number one, um, Crusader 2 is being made by an incredibly small team. On the production side, we only have about two full-time programmers in the game and a handful of full-time artists. So while that may seem crazy, we're quite successful at punching above our weight. And you know, we like to think we are sort of, you know, a small developer doing big things. Number two, each artist and programmer we're currently working on Crusader 2 is located in a different city. So we've got one in New York State, one in South Africa, you know, a number scattered around the UK. You know, so we like to think we are quite an international company making a very British game. Number three, in terms of art, we've got more than a thousand unique models created for the game. Um, you know, the number processed in-game will be far lower, so the performance will be nice and streamlined. But you know, whichever way you look at it, that is quite a lot of art for a relatively small team. By the end of 2013, more than uh, 600,000 lines of code will have been written for the game. You know, that sounds like a hell of a lot, but you know, uh, a lot of it's for optimization and you know, just polish. And of course, there'll be a lot more where that came from for sort of post launch features and content. So, yeah, seems like a lot, but you know, we get there somehow. So during our lunch breaks, we've spent over 100 hours each playing Team Fortress 2 and, you know, the number of hours in Crusader 2 is sort of in the thousands at the moment with, you know, expected to go up and that's obviously per employee. So we've got a lot of, you know, gaming done in the, uh, in the space of time between the sort of, you know, the start of development and the end. So many of the original team members who worked on Strong Crusader 1 still work at Firefly. This includes Simon Eric, company co-founders and designers, uh, Andy, senior programmer, Darren, QA manager, uh, Darren, uh, senior artist, so you know there's quite a lot of the original team in there, so hopefully they can bring some of the original flavour of the game with along with the new blood of you know people like me, new employees coming in and you know giving it a bit of a fresh flavour. So our QA department has already spent thousands of hours testing Crusader 2 and uh, we haven't even entered beta yet. So uh, you know by the time release comes out we're hoping to be in the sort of tens of thousands of hours. Um, you know, the thing about Crusader 2 is that we want to spend you know, a good number of months polishing and play testing. So we're hoping that figure will be nice and high and you know, it'll, it'll mean we've spent a long time playing the game, getting the difficulty curve and getting everything just right. So the entire Crusader 2 soundtrack is being composed by Robert Uvino, uh, the guy behind the original Stronghold of Crusader soundtracks. You know, as Rob pointed out in his awesome behind the scenes video. <laughs> very much staying faithful to the sort of sound and tone of the original game um, yeah but he isn't afraid to try some new music so expect you know a similar style to the original game but have an all new soundtrack in there as well. So this will be the first time Firefly are publishing a Crusader game with the original published by Take Two in 2002. Um, what this means of course is that we'll be able to make our own design decisions, we'll be able to decide what features go into the game and um, generally how faithful we want to stay to the original Crusader, which is a lot. <laughs> so Crusader 2 will include a full skirmish mode at launch. We realise most people know this by now, but we still see the occasional question being asked about it. So I just wanted to be absolutely clear, yes, skirmish mode, rejoice. <laughs>